It's everything you put on the top of your list to start a season. We want to win our division, and we want to get into the playoffs, obviously, and we want home field advantage. So everything's on the table for Baltimore against the Miami Dolphins at home, an environment where they thrive. m and Bank Stadium on a gorgeous Sunday in December to close out the calendar year. I'm ready. You're ready. You're ready. You're ready. You don't do all that all year long to not waste an opportunity like we have tonight. Let's show them exactly who we are from the first step to the last step. Let them know every play. We here. We the break. Coming deep near side, looking for OBJ at the five, reaches up. He makes the catch. He's inbound. Lobs far side. He's got Hill. He's got a touchdown. Let's go, D. Come on. And he's sacked Kyle Van Noy. Brought yeah. down Adafi Owe with a sack. Throws, intercepted. Roquan Smith has it. Roquan Smith will hand the ball back to the Ravens offense. Drops the throw. Blitz pressure coming. Lamar's pass is caught. One hand by Zaya Likely. He's to the 15, 10, 5. Leap for the pylon. Touchdown, Ravens. Cut back to the 15. Slip cut of a tackle. Zay Flowers. Touchdown, Ravens. Pat Ricard. One hand catch for the fullback. The Hayes of the bar. It's an exciting day. You know, we got the Pro Bowl results last night, and uh, we're going to tell the first time guys today in my office that they made it. How you doing? Hey, I got bad news. What's up, man? How you doing? Good. Been good? Yeah. Hey, man. You made it. Pro Bowl? Pro Bowl. Finally. You made it, man. Oh, no. All that work. Finally. You deserve it. You made the Pro Bowl. Yeah. You did. Wow. I got a little nervous. When I was like, <laughs> I was like you good? Let's go. Hey, you earned it, man. Let's go. Thank you. That's awesome. Best center in the league. You made the pull ball. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you did, you ran. Oh, well man. deserved. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Nice point. Everybody's tight, man. Yes, sir. You had an amazing season. Yes, sir. You're an amazing player. Yes, sir. Pull ball, baby. Thank you. Congrats. Thank you. Appreciate it. I don't even know how to think about it right now. It's crazy. That's pull ball, man. You believe that? That's crazy. Oh, my God. How hard you've worked? We're going to have to. Drive my dad down. He's gonna be jumping all over everywhere. You did it, man. You're a pro ball linebacker. Well, all that work. I don't think it's set in yet. Honestly, it's kind of wild. Like I mean, I'm only 22 and second year of the league, and things are looking good for us right now. But that's that's dope. These first-time guys that make it, it's a special thing. In most cases, probably a significant goal that these guys have to be at the very top of their profession, at their positions in the league. It gives them a chance to see how other people who are very, very involved in our sport feel about them as players. John's going to tell you guys at the team meeting. The guys have made it. It's awesome. And every single guy is incredibly deserving, and we're proud of everybody. What do we got, Megan? Yeah. Wasn't talking to us. Darnold to throw, fires to the end zone, it's intercepted! Marcus Williams with the pick, and with one minute left to play on Christmas, the Hayes in the barn! See you guys later! What wasn't impressive, it was a complete team win, and that's what 
you always want. This is a good football team. This is the best football team in the NFL right now. Everyone had their piece in that victory. It was physically and emotionally draining. The preparation that went into that game, the travel both to and from, and then a short week, it does help that they're returning home. They don't have to get back on the road to face the Dolphins, but it's gonna be in form of adversity that they're gonna have to overcome. And that's what this team has proven to be able to do, especially in the back half of this season. The challenges seem to almost heighten their sense of awareness and desire to prove people wrong. Okay, so today you know the deal. Let's have a great Friday. You guys have been doing that all year, all right? Keep getting better every Friday. And it's gonna take that in this game. Communication, as you guys know, defense out in front of what they're doing. It's challenging. I mean, we had a, we've had a number of big games in a row. We've had must wins all the way all the way through, and we traveled to the West Coast Monday night game, traveling back. We lose one day of rest, recovery, and preparation. That being said, our guys don't have to be told. They already know. They know how important it is. They know what a great opponent's coming in here. They know the stakes. We're the hungriest team in the league, just for the simple fact that. You could tell by our demeanor. I mean, last week showed that, you know, we, we, we don't take the disrespect lightly with uh, how the media portrays us and really we keep the outside noise, the outside noise and just show it between the lines. I believe we, we was already motivated, you know. Um, like I always say, you know, we chasing right now. I believe we are locked in. He said, I remember in 2019, we won games just like this, only to fall short come playoff time. So nothing else really matters. We're going to take it one practice at a time, right. one game at a time, one day at a time. Because at the end of the day, nothing else matters. I feel like Lamar is playing at that magical level where it's, you know, having the league on notice that he is the front runner of the MVP. I mean, you could say what you want about him, but every time he shows you on Sunday that he is who he is. MVP, Lamar Jackson, MVP. The award has become similar to the Heisman in college football, where it's the best quarterback on the best team. And I think what Lamar's proven is that he is the best quarterback on the best team in the NFL in week 17. There's still work to be done. As much as this game is about Dolphins, Ravens, it's also Tua and Lamar. And I think what Lamar's done all season is he's constantly elevated this team. There have been challenges, both injuries on offense, defense, and Lamar's been the constant. And I think that's something, when you look at the MVP campaign, should be valued pretty high. The Ravens have been the best defense in the NFL this year, and the Dolphins on the other side, since Jalen Ramsey's come back, they've been one of the best. I'm looking at Van Ginkle, and I'm looking at Bradley Chubb. Can they keep Lamar Jackson in the pocket? Can they not allow him to just absolutely destroy the game? If we come in here on Monday, and we're oohing on over the plays that Lamar Jackson made, where he made two people miss, rolled out to his left, threw a pass deep down the field, and Isaiah likely went up and grabbed it, or Zay Flowers. I think that is the thing that's going to determine the game. I'm going to take every play from the first quarter to the last quarter. You know, they're a great team. And really just understand that, keep the main things the main things. You know, a lot of teams could preach that, you know, they all fight for each other, but I feel like uh, every Sunday we show the world that, you know, we all got each other's back. We don't need to get all fired up on Friday, you know? We'll time this thing up for one o'clock on Sunday, right? We'll time it up for one o'clock on Sunday, and we'll go out there and we'll play our best game. Our roughest game, our fastest game, our smartest game, our toughest game, right? Our best game. All right, that's what we're gonna do. That's what we've been doing, and that's what we're gonna continue to do for the rest of the season. Everybody good? Okay? But today, let's have a great Friday. Let's have great preparation. Let's get ourselves ready to go. The Ravens return home today, and it is a matchup of the top two records in the AFC. The Ravens come into today's New Year's Eve matchup with Miami with a chance to clinch a division title and the top seed in the AFC playoff race. And like six days ago, it will take another big effort by the defense to stop an excellent offensive opponent. Let's keep the main thing the main thing. We go out and do our job. That's all we need. Dominate. Dominate. Run to the ball. Have your brother's back. And we'll come out with a win. Ravens at 12 and three, the Dolphins at 11 and four. Every time that they had to play a good game, they played a good game. How hard a physical can we play? How hard a physical can we play? Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, let's get it, come on. Come on, turn up. Everybody take the helmet off real quick. Yeah, let me see them eyes real quick. I want that type of energy all day. Look that man across from you and let him know, I'm here all day, all right? I want that banner 
in that room, all right? I wanted to say AFC North champ, all right? We got one job today. Look them in the eye and let them know every snap, all right? All right, let's get it. Dark slide on three, one, two, three. Dark slide. They understand one thing, you win, you clinch. Every game has to come through Baltimore. I'm coming. I promise you, all my life, I'm coming. Let's show them exactly who we are from the first step to the last step. This AFC North football, this is Baltimore Ravens. Yeah, you know what time it is? You know what time it is? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, empty the tank. That's it. We get it, short week, I don't give a damn. You're tired, I'm tired, I don't give a I'm ready. You're ready. You're ready. You're ready. You don't do all that all year long to not waste an opportunity like we have tonight. Let them know every play. We here. We the Ravens. Come on, baby. Maybe the most significant inactive list we have seen all season. Safety, Kyle Hamilton. Cornerback, Brandon Stevens. Starting guard, Kevin Zeitler. With the injuries that have suddenly caught up with the Ravens, a win today means two weeks of rest before you have to play in the postseason. And this first drive is going to give us indication of how the Miami Dolphins are going to attack the ball three of his defense. Come on! Come on! Let's go, D! Come on! Well, the Dolphins go eight plays, 75 yards. And the number one scoring offense in the NFL strikes first against the number one scoring defense in the NFL. Now the roles will be reversed, and the Ravens will have the ball for the first time. Marvel throw on third down, goes to Hill. Cuts it along, picks up the first down. Hell yeah. Come on. Stepping up in the pocket, going deep, far sideline, and it is caught by Zay Flowers at the Miami 37-yard line. Yeah! Yeah, man! Dolphins bring a blitz, pass complete over the middle. Bateman has it at the 25, stutter step, gets a block, ducks to the 20-yard line and taken down there with a Ravens first down as he picks up 14. That boy Bate, man, he's always open. You see, like, the top separating receiver in the league, one of them. Yes, bro, top three. He's always open. Lamar wants to throw, steps up, lobs, far side. He's got Hill. He's got a touchdown. Justice Hill down the right sideline and in for the score. And that is the first receiving touchdown in Justice Hill's career. Let's go, man. Come on. Come on. Come on! Come on! Open all day! Open all day! Come on! Come on, D! It's our turn! Out of the cage, I'm gonna get him! All of my haters turn into a victim! Let off the leash, got a sickle! They don't expect it, so we're about to hit him! Try to keep up with the rhythm, never lose focus cause we're on a mission. See how they squirm me cause we're so determined. You looking for greatness, that's the definition. Call them and tell them you ready. Throw a game on back to levy. You know who's still on the throne and who ain't trying to hope you get the message. Hey, bro, look at you, he knew he wasn't gonna no be it. That's that speed, baby. <laughs> yeah. Woo. Come on, fellas. Let's go. And he's sacked back at the 37-yard line. Kyle Van Noy. Hey, turn up! Come on! And for Van Noy, that makes it a career-high eighth sack of the season. Hey, turn up then! Turn up then! Lamar to throw. Sets his feet. Throws complete. Nelson Aguilar steps across the tackle of the 30. Gets out to the 35-yard line. And we got LeBron. <laughs> we got LeBron. Dolphin show blitz. They bring it. Come on, eight. Lamar steps up in the pocket, coming deep, near side, looking for OBJ at the five, reaches up, he makes the catch, he's inbound, and down at the two-yard line. What a grab by OBJ. Yes, OBJ 
AJ reached up. Oh, he no, made he the catch. It. He made that catch. Both feet uh, were in bounds. Yeah, no, he caught that ball. An unbelievable catch. He leaped up, leaned back, made the catch. That's a catch. That's a crazy catch, bro. But Lamar threw that straight in the sky. Upon further review, the catch stands. First and goal, Ravens, a football yeah. length inside the Miami two. And what a catch by OBJ. Give us a Gus Edwards, the boss is in! Touchdown, Ravens! And the Ravens grab the lead for the first time this afternoon. So I think they like must have forgot. If they can go down, get any type of points before half, and get the ball back and score again, the probabilities of winning increases. Lamar will start to drive with the shotgun. Lamar with time coming deep, looking for flowers. He's got him open at the Miami 30. Makes the catch. He's to the 20. Cuts back to the 15. Slips out of a tackle. Zay Flowers. Touchdown Ravens. That was too fast. Bomb them, stay! 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 With that catch, he breaks Torrey Smith's Ravens rookie record. He now has 842 receiving yards. Hey, come here, good luck, Tom. I told you, I told you to run past. I told you. going crazy, man. We got to do our part. Got to do our part. Now, Rod, if the defense can get you a stop, you still get the ball back with three timeouts and the two-minute warning. Defense needs to go out there. Do not play soft in the two-minute situation. Hey, let's go, D. Come on, baby. Who ah! takes the snap ahead of the two-minute warning. Pumps, throws, intercepted. Ah! Roquan Smith has it. Brings it along the near sideline at midfield. Stiff arms a man. Go, Ro! Still on his feet. 40-yard line and finally taken out of bounds. Go, in Ro! The bench area. Roquan Smith will hand the ball back to the Ravens offense with 150 left in the half. Go, Ro! Go, Ro! <laughs> Bro, he, he caught that smooth as he says. Woo! You do! You do! You do! You do! You do! You do!
the two player and they motion at the two player. You look like an athlete. I'm waiting. No, you ain't going to wait. Hey, look, that was big. I've been waiting on you to catch one of them all year. Now put another seven up, Bo. And the Ravens face a fourth down and seven. Lamar drops the throw. Blitz pressure coming. Lamar's pass is caught. One hand by Isaiah Likely. He's to the 15, 10, 5. Leap for the pylon. Touchdown, Ravens! Oh, my God! Come on, man! Isaiah Likely. It is one hand Sunday as everybody's grabbing the ball. Plucking it like fruit off a tree with one hand. Yeah! He got the MVP chance, and rightfully so. That was that was filthy. On a turn of events. Oh my god. On the fourth and oh six? Lamar Jackson, how's this for our first half? 12 of 14, 255 yards, and three touchdowns. NFL record, 800 rush yards, and a QB? Hey, 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 y'all come to let me take you back to last year, week two. The Ravens blew out to a huge lead against the Dolphins, 35 to 14, and wound up losing 41 to 38. This is a different football team, though, than it was last year. I think this football team has learned how to finish football games, and that's that Super Bowl quality that you need in a team. Ravens will have the ball first to start the second half after winning the opening coin toss and deferring. Plenty of game, plenty of game left. Justice Hill awaits the Jason Sanders kick and the second half is underway. This one will be taken by Hill at the three, brings it across the 10. Near side 20, he's got a block 30. Near sideline 40, Hill to midfield, no flags down, Hill to the 40, 30, one man to beat 20, and he's finally pushed out of bounds. At the 16-yard line, Justice Hill will hand the ball to Lamar Jackson in the offense right out of the gate in the red zone. Was that on the kickoff return? God, uh. Oh, outstanding way to start the second half of the Baltimore Ravens. Great job, great job. Great job. Great job. Get ready to go score. Yes, sir. I'm going. First and goal, Raven. Ball is at the Miami 7. Hard the up back. Just the deep back. Jackson off a play fake. Lob, he's got a man wide open. Isaiah likely walks in with his second touchdown of the day. Woo! Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on, man. Fourth touchdown of the day for Lamar Jackson. Second touchdown reception for Isaiah likely. Nice job. Hey, remind everybody, we've been here before. Yeah, okay. Okay. keep scoring, keep the pressure on. Yep. I ain't even out there. I threw the Sally with you. I was like, oh, should I run out there? No, nah, don't run out there. No penalties, not today. <laughs> yeah, look at it, bro. Look, in a normal day, in a normal game against a normal opponent, you feel really good. But after last year, where the Ravens led 35 14 and the Dolphins came back and won the game, you cannot be overly confident against an explosive offense like Miami's. Not today, bro. <laughs> Tua wants to throw, has time, pumps once, now he's hit and drop! Justin Matabike coming up with a sack as Justin Matabike delivers his 13th sack of the season. Beaks, sit your ass down! Hell yeah, Beaks! Now want it. Don't want this no more. Don't want this no more. Hell yeah, Beaks. Let's go to get two and three, man. Let's go to get two and three. Beat that mother... 21 point second quarter for the Ravens. A seven point third quarter so far for the Ravens. Gets the hand up. He's got a hole across the midfield. Fumbles the ball and Miami recovers. This is the stuff that makes you nervous. The Ravens have played nearly flawless today. That's their first turnover. And it comes with 8 19, but it gives the Dolphins the ball near midfield. Come on, babe. 
Two and a throw. Down the middle, it is. Intercepted. Geno Stone has it at the Ravens' 37-yard line. And the Ravens answer a turnover with a turnover. gas offensively and defensively if they can go down here and match the score and tell the Dolphins no this is our game yeah, this is can, our home you could send it back to South Florida with a time-consuming touchdown drive here you know what let's get another drive one more drive you know I guess we'll get a good job. I'm the winner, the finisher, vendor, the better. Just go and get out of my way. I'ma keep fighting the thunder, the lightning. You frighten, it's best to stay out of my life. Now with the talking, you better keep walking. It's about to get popping for real. It's not an option, you must have forgotten. The boss of our bosses is here. Cause I got the power, I've done it for hours to make you a coward and sticks. Cause I'll be on top and not gonna drop. Our five Never yards deep. Fakes the hand off to Gus Edwards. Lob to a wide open Pat Ricard. One hand catch for the fullback, and one hand Sunday continues with a Ravens touchdown. Oh! <laughs> Project Pat! Let's go! Come on, Pat! Hey, that was a nice little catch. I think it's the day of the one hand catches. Check yeah. the final score. It's about you, uh, to be. Why'd you use the other hand? Bro, these boys put up 40, 42. Oh my God. Bro, our offense is too crazy, man. Wide open, I look the ball, I'm like, oh shit. You ever have high. nervous when you gotta put one hand up? Well, yeah. yeah. Hell yeah. Bro, my heart would be like this. It's routine, but he's trying to breathe and be like, okay, here we go. Come on. Crowd sticking around. They want to celebrate this New Year's Eve. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Tua under pressure, hit from behind, and brought down a Dafiole with a sack. Well, that might have been his best get off of the year. Because as soon as that ball was snapped, he was by the offensive tackle. <laughs> The fifth sack of the year for Adafi Owe, who just avoided a penalty flag for jumping into the neutral zone ahead of the snap. Bro, it was so close to so close to an offside. That's an elite jump right there. No, you wasn't offside. I wasn't? No. Bro, I could have sworn I moved. Like you moved? You moved, but you like you came in your tippy toe. I was looking at it, hit his body, didn't go forward. He did it like this. this I flinched for sure. Because you was on the right side, you went like this. I said, that. Yeah, all I know is I, I was said, running harder. Oh, I, said, oh, I said, oh, he got that that fast. No, that's the most. Bro, I was running. when that down, it was, it was the quarterback. Soon as it happened, so then he snapped it right away. So it looked like an elite get off. As the Ravens defense, the stingiest in the NFL, limiting the Dolphins to 19 points. Never enough points. 
Island Wallace in the game goes in motion. They give it to Melvin Gordon up the middle. Bangs his way inside the five. Still churning to the one. Lunges across the goal line. Touchdown, Ravens! Touchdown! Shows you how close this team is because once he went through and gets the touchdown, everybody on the sideline jumped up and celebrated for him getting that touchdown. No, I'm so happy for you. Golly, <laughs> romping and stomping, stomping and romping. Three, three. Hey, hell, bro. Hell yeah, no, let's go, bro. Let's go, bro. Let's close this out. You know what time it is. And the Dolphins fumble the ball. <laughs> the Ravens kick it around and recover it at the 18-yard line. And the Dolphins are done. 4:03 left to play. The Ravens will have the ball at the Miami eight-yard line. Uh, uh, that'll do. That'll do. That first play looking nice. Tyler Huntley to throw down the seam. It is caught. Carly Kohler, <laughs> touchdown. Charlie! Charlie! <laughs> Dude, that ball felt like it was in the air for a like, Come on. Dude, I Come thought, on. I thought hey, you were going to like, come on. Was like, you can celebrate now on New Year's Eve. This year, the road to the Super Bowl in the AFC runs through Russell Street. We got to a sack. We the kings of the north. Let's get it. We the kings of the north. Hey. Hey. Coach, 50 burgers? Yes, sir. That 50 burger? 50 burger? And listen to the crowd with the MVP chant for Lamar. Oh, yeah, let go, bro. And you can hear the celebration beginning here in Baltimore. It'll be a fun fireworks night as the Ravens bring in the new year as the top seed in the AFC. These Brooks don't know a hard I know. <laughs> they think this easy. <laughs> Took me 10 years to do this. It's on to the locker room to celebrate a division title, top seed in the AFC, bye week, and home field advantage throughout the playoffs. New Year! Happy New Year, baby! Let's go! Ah! Oh no, help me out, brother. Help me out! Help me out! Help me out! Help me out! Help me out. guys inside I don't think I've ever seen I've never seen a more impressive performance from the team in a game or in a season what you guys did in this game think about the game think about the way the game started all right nobody blinked nobody bats an eye all right get back get squared away that's how you do it and that's how you've been doing it all year right you go out there come back here go across there come back here play there I'm proud of you I'm proud of you I'm bleeding, I'm so proud of you. <laughs> uh, put it on the forehead right there. 
And everybody, you win, you win the division, everybody gets a game ball. Everybody in the circle gets a game ball. I'm on, I gotta talk about some guys. I gotta talk about some guys. Roquan, interception, man. Yes, sir. Zay Flowers, rookie receiving record. All right. Man, it couldn't go no better way my first my first year. Appreciate y'all boys. Love y'all boys, man. Let's keep fighting. Yeah. Yeah. I say it likely. Two Ooh. touchdowns. Yeah. Yeah. Tight ends. Yeah. Tight ends. Yeah. And, yeah. and the tight ends. Very four likely. touchdowns. Four touchdowns. Yeah. Charlie Kohler, first ever. Yeah. Yeah. y'all boys man I love playing with y'all uh, it wouldn't be a better place to uh, be right now uh, I don't been through a lot so you know this feels amazing bro so let's keep let's keep stacking these yeah. Yeah. ourselves up for success, you know what I mean? It's got to come through the bank in these black and purple unis. Go through this defense. This offense is crazy, man. Everything's right in front of us, so let's go ahead. Keep preparing. Y'all enjoy this moment, you know what I mean? It don't come it don't come by every now and then. So just enjoy this moment. Enjoy the night. Happy New Year, all that. How about Gino Stone? How about the corners? How about the corners? Oh, no, no, no. Hey, hey, no. 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 Come on, corners. Chin up, chest up. Hey, chin up, chest up. What do you got to say, Darbs? You guys played You played unbelievable. You played unbelievable. All right. And then, second ever, second ever, perfect passer rating. All right. I mean, you talk about dominant performance. Yeah. Yeah. Tyler Hartley. Get our quarterbacks up here, man. Before we do, before we, before we do, I want to, I gotta get, I do got, I got a couple game balls, okay? First game ball, if Shanda, if Shanda Bergant would come up here, because I believe this team, I believe this team, come on, Shanda, come on, this is OJ's wife. OJ, that's the OJ right there. To me, this team epitomizes the spirit of O.J. Bergantz, all right? Resilience, persistence, toughness, okay? Spiritual power right there, okay? This game ball is going to O.J. and Chandra, all right? For everything they do, for who they are. Thank you guys, thank you so much. I'm sure if O.J. could say it, he would say thank you all as much. He would not be any other place but here. This is the place he wants to be. This is home for us, and this is where we will be. Congratulations, enjoy yourself, and let's keep going. Yeah. 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 For, all the, for, all, for, all the, for all the great, great football players and great men that are standing in this circle, accumulated by the personnel staff, Eric DaCosta, who was great at winning. Yeah. Yeah. 
for the, for the, the staff that, that kind of works their asses off to keep you guys healthy and bring you guys back. Adrian Dixon. Oh. And the last one. Who's going to get the ring? Last but not least, Harv. Yeah. 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 But hey, appreciate you, man. Happy as hell for us, all of us. And can't wait. Keep going, man. Appreciate can't you. Wait. Thank you. <laughs> can't wait. Can't wait till Wednesday. Can't wait till Wednesday. It's an, hey, it's an honor. It's an honor to coach you, men. It's an honor to coach with these coaches right here. It's, a, it's the best football team. It's the best bunch of men. Best bunch of people I've ever been around. Okay. Nothing can stop you. Nothing can stop you. But I do have one more ball to give out. Uh -oh. All right. The guy that takes care of us all. All right. Gets us squared away. Yes, JD, there you go, buddy. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. JD, just for that, you're going to have to break us down. But how about Kaneko? Yeah. yeah. yeah.